A job paid, but uh, never done. A San Benito family fears they'll never get back the thousands of dollars they spent. They tell Channel 5 Sierra Pissarro checks have been cashed, but the work is not finished. Sierra? That's right, Oscar. They cleaned out their savings close to $9,000. The family is still without their custom fence that they paid for almost a year ago. 23 empty columns standing in a row. 19 panels and one steel entry door are missing. We definitely need it. The family hired Jorge Mata for the job last July. They say he also uses the name Jose. The welder was a recommendation by family. Nivia Garcia says they paid him $8,900 for supplies. First, he asked for about $2,900. A couple of days later, he comes back and he asked for um, the $6,000 check. The next time they saw him was three months later in October. He brought them fence designs to choose from. They made their selection and seven months later, still no fence. That was it. No more communication after, after that. Garcia says the family filed a police report with the constable's office. They've also sent letters to the addresses given by Mata. Those letters, though, couldn't be delivered. And they actually came back, um, uh, returned none available, or um, and another one was uh, a bogus address as well. Their calls and texts went unanswered. So did ours. Just a few hours after our attempt to call the missing welder, the Garcia family was contacted by his daughter. She told them her father got sick and fell into a coma. Garcia says they told her they just want their money back. The woman told them she'd call them about the issue. Still, no call. The family's next step is to file for a small claims case. Garcia says their hopes of getting the money back, though, aren't high at all. We'll keep you updated on their case. Live in studio, Sierra Pizarro, Channel 5 News at 6. And we did dig some digging to find out what it takes to file a small claims case. This is a Channel 5 News Extra. Small claims involve money and items valued at more than $10,000. Officials advise to know the address of the person you're suing, then visit your local Justice of the Peace Office, pick up the paperwork, and then follow the directions.